you are listening to the voice of the gospel a proclamation of the holy scripture by wisdom ministries march 8th monday let's begin this day with the blessings of god a reading from the holy gospel according to saint luke chapter 4 verses 24 to 30 he said Truly I tell you no prophet is accepted in the prophet's hometown but the truth is there were many widows in Israel in the time of Elijah when the heaven was shut up 3 years and 6 months and there was a severe famine over all the land yet Elijah was sent to none of them except a widow at Zarephath in Sidon There were also many lepers in Israel in the time of prophet Elisa and none of them was cleansed except Naaman the Syrian when they heard this all in the synagogue were filled with rage they got up drove him out of the town and led him to the brow of the hill on which their town was built so that they might hurl him off the cliff but he passed through the midst of them and went on his way the gospel of the lord praise the lord jesus christ dear friends today we celebrate international women's day women are an important part of society whether in the form of mother sister daughter girlfriend etc international women's day 2021 is a campaign with the theme choose to challenge International Women's Day is a global day celebrating the social, economic, cultural and the political accomplishment of women. So I wish you happiness, success, love, everything you deserve in this world because you are she is passion. Happy Women's Day. Dear friends, there are alternative readings that may be used on this day. The gospel is the second part of the scene in the synagogue in Nazareth where Jesus officially announces his mission as Messiah savior and liberator the first reaction was one of amazement that Jesus their townsman could speak with such power where did he get it all there was amazement but no real faith in him familiarity had blinded them to his true identity basically they rejected him for them he is just a carpenter's boy jesus says he is not surprised by this reception no prophet is ever accepted in his own country he then goes on to give two examples taken from the lives of two well known old testament prophets they are not quite examples of the prophets not being received by their own people but rather the prophets reaching out to other people non believers when there was a great famine among the israelites it was a sidonian widow who was helped by elijah sidon was the place where jesus would heal a gentle woman's daughter there were many lepers people in israel said jesus but elisa was sent to cure naaman the syrian another gentile jesus hears or incensed by what appear to them arrogant or insulting words in their minds they were not rejecting a prophet but a imposter his remarks about elisa and elijah they find highly objectionable the references to elijah and elijah help to emphasize his looks image of jesus as a prophet like those who went before him they also lay the foundation for the future mission to the gentiles dear friends we too can very easily fail to recognize the voice of god in certain people who in fact whether they are aware of it or not or bringing a message from him like the people of nazareth we can think we know them too well to have listened to them we feel it would be inconceivable that god could speak to us through such people this probably happens most of all 
with the people we meet every day of our lives. Amen. May God bless us.